hello guys welcome to the innovation lab all right guys you guys have been requesting for the uh, dc to dc boost converter repair tutorial video so we have dropped everything that we're working on to kind of make this video for you guys all right guys so we have taken apart the converter board as you guys have seen here and the goal of the tutorial video is to first of all show you guys how a dc to dc boost converter works and then we're going to go into uh, great detail to explain how to troubleshoot each component all right so as you guys can see here kind of here are the major components that you can find on this board this is the heat sink obviously and this guy right here is the power inductor and from there we have the uh, input power fuses so these are like 20 amp fuses and they have three of them connected in parallel and here is the uh, drive mosfet so for this module they're using an n-channel mosfet and this is the irf 4110 uh, mosfet i have seen a different module where they use the uh, i believe the hy 3912 mosfet and out here are the uh, output rectifier diodes so these are kind of uh, fast recovery freewheeling diodes they use at the output and they use two of them as you guys can see here and lastly we're going to be treating the board as one single component before we even spend time troubleshooting all the other components the first thing we're going to do is to test the board to make sure that um, the pwm control on the board is still functional so guys in this video we're going to be covering a lot so as you guys can see here one of the things that we always do on the board before uh, troubleshooting the board is to actually inspect the board especially after a damage we want to make sure that the components didn't sustain any damage visibly on the board so here i'm going to be using my uh, digital soldering microscope to inspect the board as you guys can see here and it makes it very easy to just look at the board especially uh, uh, depending on how your eyesight is so this helps out a lot and you don't need to have an expensive microscope like this to be able to inspect your boards during the repair you can as well use a uh, cheap uh, magnifying glass like this to just uh, zoom in on the board and look at it all right guys don't forget to subscribe to the innovation lab so you get notified as we release the main video and we are also going to be making a lot of short videos to show you guys the progress of uh, what we're doing here to troubleshoot the uh, boost converter all right my friends i'll see you guys the next video